Hey guys, welcome to today's episode. Ugh. I had to squeeze out my pecs. My name is Jamie LaRoyce. I'm an IFBB Class Physique Pro, and today's topic is how to choose the right coach. Um, if you have already, if you already competed, or you are looking to compete into a bodybuilding competition. It is a good idea if you want to start investing your money into this hobby um, to get a coach. You know, coaches are there to get the uh, the look at to look at you, give you the the right constructive criticism that you need, and to help you um, get you to that final go of winning or bringing that winning physique to the stage. Not only are they there for you for your diets and um, training, but they're also there uh, to talk to you and uh, mentor you through these hard times because bodybuilding bodybuilding is not easy. You have a lot of ups and downs and good coaches are, are really there for you, um, my opinion. Uh, let's go over the first, uh, the first bullet is look at the results. Now what that means is is look at the athletes that they have put on the stage. If you're liking what you're seeing, if you're liking that, man, they bring them in diced or hey, man, they bring them in nice and uh, you know big and full and 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 just looking on point. Then that's a plus. That's something that you uh, should stick to. Something that I'm with Team Zero, Ryan Benson with Team Zero Gravity. And when I first, I know we're going off topic, so we're gonna we're gonna start back on on two. But let me share with that, should I sh that I should have shared at the beginning. Um, I uh, I was really excited about Team Zero Gravity when I first saw them back in 2014. Whenever they would go and show up to competitions, they would bring the whole squad. You know what I mean? And everyone looked so so good. They they are all tight and shredded, and they had that team atmosphere. And that's what really attracted me to them the most is the team atmosphere because bodybuilding is a very individual sport so to to feel like you're a part of a team it, it's just another experience going into these competitions you know showing up with other team zero gravity people or or whoever your team is you, you feel like you belong you know what i mean you feel like you're a part of something and that's something that stuck out to me and that's why i joined team zero gravity so back to uh, to the bullets number two well established make sure that they have been in the game for a while they know what they're talking about because anybody can say hey I'm a I'm a coach uh, pay me and I'll get you on stage and you give them seven eight nine hundred dollars and they never competed nor do have do they ever have an athlete or if they do have an athlete they they never placed and stuff like that you don't want that if you if you're gonna spend money on a coach make sure that you get a good one, you know, uh, money well deserved. Number two, you want to look like them. Now this is more for those athletes that you see that are competing and they coach as well. So if you 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 like the way that athlete looks, okay, you you want to know what they do and you want your physique to be like theirs. So what is it, what better way to to have them coach you because they know exactly what to do because it's their body so they're gonna teach you what they taught themselves you know so it's not always a bad thing to go with athletes um, some athletes produce uh, great great protégés and and great uh, clients to step on stage uh, train strong John out of Las Vegas I believe he he's an IFBB competitor I actually hired him whenever he was NPC also, um, Team Cuts, I think. I think I competed against that guy. Or they can they compare us together. Because uh, uh, they say that our posing is really nice. Anyways, he's NPC, I believe. And he has Olympians for, uh, you know, for clients. So it's just look at a physique that you are um, attracted to um, and learn from them. You know what I mean? Last but not least, you get a good vibe. Now, whenever you contact these coaches, talk to them, you know. Uh, 
make sure that it's not all about money, you know what I mean? Let them know what you want to do. Let them give you their honest opinion. Me coming into the bodybuilding game and I were to say I want to be classic physique and I had no legs, I wasn't, I, w I didn't look like the way I, I did, you know what I mean? And I asked my coach or someone that I wanted to be my coach like, hey, I want to do classic physique. If they say, yeah, yeah, you can do it, just pay me, you know what I mean? They're just looking for my money, you know what I mean? You want to get somebody to give you their honest opinion. Now, whenever people approach me, wanting me to coach them for competitions, and they ask me what division they should be in, I, I give them my honest opinion. A lot of guys want to do class physique, but some guys just aren't ready, you know what I mean? And they need to hear that constructive criticism. And not only does the coach need to know that, uh, you know, you're stepping into something that you're not ready for, but their name is on the line, you know what I mean? When I have a client to get on stage, my name is behind them. My name is attached to them. So you need to look, find a coach that, that thinks that same way. So make sure that you talk to them, you know what I mean? You just make sure that they're not just looking for money. Because uh, there's a lot of people like that, you know what I mean? Look at their credentials, look what they've been doing, and uh, at the end of the day, if you get that good vibe, pay the man or woman. <laughs> uh, that's it for today, guys. I really hope this helped out. Um, go ahead and leave a comment below. If you have any other questions or you'd like to go over a topic, I know I've been getting comments about certain topics and I promise you guys I'm getting to them. You can also email me at jamielaroyce at gmail.com with any questions you may have. I would love to get them. Then I would read them out loud here on camera and, uh, you know, share your name and, and let everybody know that I'm, I'm answering your guys' questions. Uh, follow me on IG, Snapchat info below go ahead and subscribe if you want to keep watching these videos or keep watching these videos as they come up and hit the like button if you like it so thanks a lot guys and we're gonna go ahead and flex flex boom oh, oh. Ah, something fucking popped later guys